In this tutorial we will discuss coulometric titration. Let's start with definition. Coulometric titration is an absolute determination technique in which the mass of a given substance is determined by measuring the quantity of electricity required to electrolyze that substance. And generally it does not necessarily require a standard solution. Simply, it is an electrochemical method based upon the measurement of a quantity of electricity and the amount of materials electrolyzed according to Faraday's law of electrolysis. And this method generally used in quantitative analysis, whereby the amount of a substance set free or deposited during electrolysis is determined by measuring the number of coulombs that pass through the electrolyte. Simple illustration of coulometric titration is shown in the figure. Principle of coulometric titration. The main principle involved in the coulometric titration is the generation of the titrant by electrolysis. Then a large amount of titrant solution is added to the sample solution. Then the sample solution is electrolyzed at the anode surface. As the electrolysis proceeds, the anode potential is increased. Instrumentation of coulometric titration. It consists of electrolysis cell, platinum cathode, and anode, galvanostat, digital acquisition card, signal processing circuit, digital interface, computer, magnetic stirrer, and gas inlet etc. as shown in the figure. Here, you can see pure nitrogen gas is passed into the solution. And the solution is stirred by the help of magnetic stirrer. You can see platinum cathode and anode connected with galvanostat. And you can also see composite glass electrode connected with signal processing circuit which further connected with digital acquisition card, digital interface, and then computer. This is the general setup of the coulometric titration. Advantages of coulometric titration. This method is highly sensitive. In this method standard solution are not required because coulomb becomes pre-working substance. Both time and current can be measured with a very high degree of precision and accuracy. In this method unstable reagent like bromine Br2, chlorine Cl2, silver Ag2, and titanium Ti3 can be used. In this method very small amount of titration may be generated where necessary. Since reagent is generated from electrode, hence there is no need of burette. Very reactive species can be used as reagent. There is no requirement of dilution of sample solution. Interaction of generating solution brings more accuracy. This method is readily adopted to the remote control, this is significant in the titration of radioactive or dangerous materials. An automatic control system may be applied in this method, etc. Significance of coulometric titration The coulometric methods produces reagent in solution that would otherwise be difficult to use. Normally, volatile reactants such as chlorine, bromine, iodine or unstable reagents such as titanium, chromium, copper, silver etc. By controlling potential of electrode at a suitable value, it is possible to reduce a metal to lower valency state. Then at a more positive potential, the metal can be oxidized quantitatively to a higher valency state. And here, no indicator electrode system is necessary since the magnitude of the final current is sufficient indication of the degree of completion of the reaction. And halogens particularly bromine generated internally have widespread application in organic analysis, etc.